How does a hundred pound guitar compare to a ten thousand pound guitar? Let's find out. If you're watching this video, chances are you're not subscribed to the channel. If you like the videos we're making, hit the subscribe button below. Hi, Sam from Guitar Village here. Today we're going to check out four different acoustic guitars at four different price points. We're going to start with our cheapest acoustic guitar in the shop at £99, through to our most expensive at nearly £10,000. We've also got two other price points in between for some good comparison, and we're also going to do a blindfold test to see if I can tell the difference between the cheapest and the most expensive. We are going to compare the Tanglewoods Crossroads uh, Dreadnought model, which is £99, against the D41 Purple Martin at £10,000. So that's 100 times the price. Let's see if I can tell the difference. Okay, so guitar number one. Yeah, that's a great sounding guitar. Hearing some nice sounds in there, you've got some nice bass response, nice mid-range. Uh, the top end's there, it's bright, but it's not kind of harsh, so it's, it's a really nice sounding instrument. Thank you. So this is a brighter sounding guitar. Turns out it's quite hard to play with a blindfold on as well. It lacks that bass response guitar number one had, um, but pleasant enough sounding. Okay, so, right, the first guitar I was handed, I would say, because of the extra bass response in there, very, very uniform sound all round, it's really nicely balanced, I'm gonna go with the D41 Purple Martin, and guitar number two, I would say, was the Tanglewoods Crossroad, which was a nice sounding guitar, just lacked some of the bass response. So, how well did I do? Yep, all good. Ah, brilliant. <laughs> I'm glad about that. So, what does the Martin do that the Tanglewood doesn't? Well, nothing. They do exactly the same job. Now, that may seem crazy, but the best way I can describe it is in an analogy. Think of the Tanglewood, and it's an actor. That Tanglewood is me. Think of the Martin as being Leonardo DiCaprio. We both do the same job, but one does it in a really classy way. This is an absolutely stunning looking guitar. It's so ornate. The reason you pay so much for these is because it's made in the custom shop, the wood choice is excellent, and the amount of detailing on the guitar is incredible. I'm sure I've said this quite a few times in this video, but this is 99 pounds. Now, why is it 99 pounds? This is made in the Far East, so the production costs are much lower. The wood selection is not gonna be anywhere near as good as the Martin. In terms of sound, you know, for 99 pounds, this is an incredible guitar. It sounds great, and this would be the perfect first choice for any new guitarist. You've had your first guitar now for a couple of years, and you're thinking about buying another one. You want to step up, and I think the next logical step and price point to look at would be somewhere between 750 and maybe 1500 pounds. That sort of price point, you're going to get a guitar that you can take out to open mic nights, you can go and rehearse with your friends with it, maybe do a few gigs as well with it, and it's going to be hardly enough to, you know, withstand the road as well. For that sort of price point, at just over a thousand pounds, I thought I would look at this Eastman E10D. Now this is very reminiscent of a Martin D18 style guitar. This is an excellent guitar. For just over a thousand pounds, this sounds really nice. 
it feels much more refined than the Tanglewood. And you know, with all the songs you've learned on here, I think it's gonna help you progress to the next level as well. So you've been doing some open mic nights, jamming with your friends a little bit, and now it's time to get, again, a little bit more serious with your guitar playing. The next price point on is £3,000, and I think the guitar that's perfect for that sort of price is the Martin D28. This is an industry standard workhorse dreadnought guitar. It looks great, it sounds great, it plays great. You've heard this on so many recordings. This is the ideal guitar if you want to start maybe recording yourself as well. You want to do a few more gigs or maybe you want to put a small tour together. I can't think of any guitar that would be better suited for that sort of price than the D28. So your first royalty checks come through. You start to earn a bit of money from music. You've been working really hard at it. Maybe you've got a bit of savings put aside and you want to treat yourself. Where else do you look? but a super high-end Martin. So at the £10,000 price point, the D41 Purple Martin with its incredible looking inlays, its exquisite sound, just incredible looking woods, it's the perfect way to splash out on yourself. So there's our four different acoustic guitars at four different price points. I hope this video has helped and will point you in the right direction so you can find the perfect guitar for you. All the guitars used in today's video will be linked in the description below. So if you want to find out any more information about them, check them out down there. We really enjoyed making this video and we hope you enjoyed watching it. We'll be bringing out new videos every Friday at 4 p.m. So to stay up to date with us, make sure you hit the subscribe button and don't forget to give us a thumbs up too. Mm -hmm.